Back with Ian Adadad at the Tropical Smoothie Cafe. Wrapping it up nearly for today with the Grants for NABA. And uh, back to that Deep River deal with the Mud Dog. Just uh, briefly, how about the layout down at the oh, it's uh, beautiful. Ramsour it. location? Reggie Allred has done a great job with uh, oh, the, the infield. is beautiful. Uh, the mound, the home. I mean, it was a really neat place. And honestly, I'd rather go there than to a minor league game. Or I'd rather go see the high times. I like those little old-timey, cozy little fields like that. It was very cool. You know, they played a lot of Legion ball there through the years. But that guy, he's done a great job, Reggie Allred. He runs that whole program. Things are going pretty good for them this year, though. Yeah. But I, was, I wanted to mention another team. The Greensboro Yankees have been have been doing very well in our league. I, and uh, um, they're kind of right there in that mix with everybody. I didn't want to forget about them. Now, who runs that show for the Yankees? Uh, uh, who are some uh, of their guys? Are Omar up? Wright. Omar Wright. Is that uh, a Dudley guy from years ago? No, no, he went to A and T, but no, no, sounds and, yeah, but he didn't. Um, he didn't go to uh, A and T. I mean, he didn't go to Dudley. But they, I don't. They had some. They had one or two guys from Dudley because I know some of my guys knew their guys. I don't know their names. Mm -hmm. You know any of the guys on the team over there are doing pretty well for the Yankees? Any Yankees guys you can drop in? Their names, I don't, I don't know. Um, I know some of my first name. I don't know their. Gotcha. Yeah. Gotcha. That team is definitely coming. But some on. of my players and some of the players from the league know some of their guys. I'll, I'll try to find out. Gotcha. Gotcha. So. But Omar Wright doing a good job. Oh yeah, very good job. He's one of the most organized baseball guys I know. Very passionate. Um, easy to work with. I mean. If you could sum up what uh, it's been like so far this season in just a few words, how would you sum it up? I know there's. A lot of crazy things have happened. Ben, you mentioned the umpire situation with the mud dogs, you mentioned oh, the injury man. you had. Yeah, that was in the same week. started 0-4. That was the next ahead. night. The next night I got hit in the head. Man. Yeah, so I, I, I did think, well, maybe I didn't do something right did that happen, but then I quickly didn't think that. You may have been overthinking <laughs> yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, uh, no, it's been a um, – I've said – I've told the guys it's going to be the best summer of your life, and um, it, it's it's been – it's been interesting. It's been different. We have, you know, 19 new guys on our team. Um, and uh, to gel the team, I know it's a new era for us. Uh, but it, it has been great, and uh, the guys are great, and, and the, our coaches are great. And just it's different. been a memorable year, then. Yeah, I mean, you know, there's a guy for the Dodgers named Luke Guthrie who's he's so passionate. He's about 33. Um, but just like watching a guy like that warm up before every game, and he's had some big hits for them. He had a big hit the other night to beat the Yankees. Uh, he, he just loves baseball, and um, guys like that inspire me. Because sometimes yeah, I've done it all, really. I started a league, I, you know, played out a league, beat the, you know, beat this team, beat that team, won championships. And so now that, you know, sometimes you have to pull from those kind of people and stuff like that. So. Well, give us a couple final thoughts of the Tropical Smoothie Cafe we're at here today. Well, it's a great atmosphere. Um, I always enjoy coming here. And, uh, you mentioned the watermelon. What other uh, flavors have you tried here? Uh, the cucumber. Yeah. One, yeah, is very good. I had the it's, allergy here one day, and it sure was yeah, good. Yeah, that's good, good for you, actually. But uh, it's very fresh, different food. You know, it's just different. Like, you know, sometimes when you – I mean, I do like Chick-fil-A, but uh, – I mean, I've become a fan of this place, and at first I was like, well, I just thought it was smoothies, but it's all kinds of different Got the wrap sandwiches. sandwiches, wraps, it's, uh, there's a lot of pineapples and avocados and stuff like that. So. Very healthy, and plus in warm weather, this is the way you yeah, eat. Yeah, it's different, yeah, it's a little bit. When it's so yeah. hot outside, you want to eat more like this. Yes. Yeah. Enid, keep up the good work Thank with you. the uh, Greensboro NAB and the Reds. And, uh, Thank you for all any, you Oh, yeah, any uh, final predictions for the rest of this year for the league? Um, I think I think there will be a team from the league to rise up and probably be up there for a while. I think there's three teams that are going to – I can see them kind of growing, and that, I'm excited about that. Um, a lot of people have put hard work into building their teams and stuff like that. That's what you want to see. So. And, uh, we, we, you know, working at Western Guilford, I mean, Wyatt Smith has, has, has worked so hard there, and we, we expect to hand that field back to them in tip-top shape better than ever for them and, um, and, and uh, one other thing I was going to tell you about that Hall of Fame uh, that, one of the ideas you know I was talking to Coach Causey about him doing a in his ear era uh, you know uh, uh, like an all like a lineup of the greatest players of Western or in his ear and stuff like that like a uh, Ryan Thomas who he said would be his DH making Smith um, 
I can't think of the other guy, the pitcher that was in that on that championship team that lost uh, when Causey made it. I can't think of his name, but uh, just kind of sometimes looking back to celebrate what we've done and, and, and reflecting back. I've been doing that a lot lately, and that's how I've come up with some of these ideas for the Reds, the NABA, and even Western Guilford, you know, on senior night. So. Listen, keep it rolling, and we'll Thanks. see you again in a few weeks. Thank you.